welcome back to my channel. Today is the vlog of the Kira Bailey release at the San Francisco place, uh, the AG store in San Francisco. I was really excited to come to this release because I was planning on meeting Kat from the AG Cafe, which was super fun, and there'll be some footage from that at the end. But first of all, when I got in, there was this display of Kira in the front, and it was so cute, and they had a bunch of other displays with showing all of her outfits and accessories, and the little animals were so cute and there were also a bunch of big posters. Also along with that, uh, the display for the girl of the year from two years ago wasn't there anymore. I forgot who that was. I'm thinking it was Gabriella. I think they'd had that there before. But anyway, they only had Blair and Joss. Actually, I don't even think they still had Joss's display up. I'm kind of confused now because I don't remember seeing hers. But they still had Blair's for sure. They also had a little mini stop motion over there and they had a ton of other, oh, they had all her accessories, her full collection there, which was so cool. And I love these pajamas. I'm pretty sure the koala pajamas are my favorite out of her collection, along with this cute little jumper, which is probably my second favorite, even though it does remind me a lot of Julie, um, which I've heard a lot from other people as well. And then they have her big accessories over here, which is so cute. And honestly, her whole collection is really cute. I'm not crazy about her story, but I do think her collection is really cute. They also had this cute little fairy bread, which I thought didn't look too realistic, but it honestly is so cute, even though it doesn't have texture or anything. I think that's so crazy. So if you don't know, fairy bread is an Australian dessert, kind of. It's basically just white bread and butter and sprinkles, I think. It might not be butter. Maybe it's just white bread and sprinkles. I think there's butter, though. It's, like, really crazy. You should look it up. Also, along with that, you can see in her outfit, there's, like, the jacket and thing, and the jacket had the sleeves connected to it, which was kind of a bummer. They also had the around the world outfits, which I think is kind of cool. They had like Ireland and England and uh, Japan and a bunch of different places. I can't remember them all at the moment, but I think they're really cute. I do think they remind me a lot of like our generation and stuff. And it feels like the accessories and the actual outfit themselves aren't super realistic to the culture there. Like the Japanese is like kawaii and stuff. And I don't think people really dress like that in Japan. I could be completely off because like I don't live there obviously. But um, for me, it just feel like it's not super accurate and reminds me more of like what people think it is compared to what it actually is. Also, uh, here's some footage of us getting photos of our dolls, me and Kat from the AG Cafe. We got, we got some photos from our dolls in front of the uh, American Girl store and that was super fun. And also I got a photo with her, which was really cool. But obviously we can't show our faces because we don't show our faces on YouTube. But overall, that's it for this vlog, and I was really excited to show you guys everything that's there. I hope you were able to get a good idea on what Kira's collection was if you weren't able to go yourself. Thank you so much to Kat for meeting me there. It was really fun to get to know you and get to talk to you. And yeah, so that's it, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye!